Oh. Good morning, CNS. Today is Thursday, December 8th, 2022, and it's an A day. I'm Paige Pangaro. And I'm Dylan Gamora. Dylan Gamora. Good morning, everyone. Attention to anyone listening to me right now. If you are sitting next to a senior who is sleeping or has their music playing too loudly, please nudge them and tell them to listen up. Seniors, are you paying attention? Your senior quotes for the yearbook are due December 22nd. There are important guidelines you must follow, so be sure to read them all so your quote doesn't get rejected without your knowledge. You can find the guidelines by scanning the QR code on the screen right now or by going to the yearbook website. Attention members of UMOJA, the club that celebrates diversity at CNS. We have a meeting after school today to do a few things. We need to work on publicizing our winter drive for kids at Roxell. We need to plan our holidays party for next week, and we need to... We need some creative types to help our school acknowledge and support Kwanzaa. Please come and bring a friend. The CNS d and Club is meeting today from 2 to 3 in, cl- in Cafe 1. We are still forming our tables for this spring. Come learn how to play the world's greatest role-playing game. So we're going to take a break for a second and bring you a segment where we had students and Steve, the security guard, finish song lyrics. Here it is. Okay. Who am I here with? Steve. And are you ready to finish the Christmas lyrics? I am. Let's do this. Okay. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. Very next day, you gave it away. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here with... Sydney Nashi. All right. And you have to finish the Christmas lyrics. It's the most wonderful time of the year. <clears throat> jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. No. <laughs> <laughs> Who am I here with? Turner Wheaton. Okay, um, this one has a lot of different, so you just gotta get one of them. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas, everywhere you go. Huh? (laughs) It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas, everywhere you go. Toys filled in every store. I think, yeah, yeah, pretty much. (laughs) Let's. (laughs) I'm here with... (laughs) And... You have to finish the Christmas song lyrics. Ready? Jingle bells, jingle bells. Nice job, Kevin. (laughs) The Navy will be in the Student Center in the cafe one today during lunches. In the Navy, you'll find there is much more to much more to be gained than a regular paycheck. In fact, the Navy's experience can shape your future through outstanding financial benefits, great career potentials, and lifestyle of freedom and personal growth that you've been waiting for. Stop by the Student Center and see what the Navy can do, can offer for you. Hey seniors, scholarship opportunities are available now in the Summit Federal Credit Union. Graduating seniors with plans to attend a college or university after high school can apply. Learn more and apply at summitfsu.org slash scholarships or see the Career Center website. The Career Center is offering the ASAV, A-S-V-A-B, Career Exploration Assessment being held Tuesday, December 13th at noon in the Career Center. This program can assist students in making their plan for after high school. Register with Ms. Deaver in the Career Center website under Current Events for more information. And now here's sports with Drew. No. It says Drew. Sarah. Oh, and now here's sports with Sarah. CNS Ice Hockey stole the game last night against RFA, winning 4-2. to two. The game was scoreless in the first period, but early in the second period, Braden Porter nets one in the power play. After the boys controlled the game, the North Stars improved to 2-1. to one. Great job, North Stars. Let's send it over to Drew for a special announcement. This was the scene at the War Memorial a couple years ago for the Syracuse Crunch's annual teddy bear toss. And on Saturday night at 3 p.m., the North Stars ice hockey team faces off against IHC at the War Memorial in downtown Syracuse. When the North Stars score their first goal, you can throw a new or slightly used teddy bear onto the ice to later be donated to local children for the holidays, so no one goes without a gift. If you would still like to donate a stuffed animal to the cause but cannot make the game, do not worry. You can give all bears or stuffed animals to Mr. Bednarski in the athletic office office to donate on Saturday. All rise as the New York Yankees re-signed superstar outfielder Aaron Judge to a massive nine-year contract yesterday. Case closed. Judge will now have the highest salary of any position player in the MLB at around $40 million per year. 
In the NBA, Julius Randle of the Knicks dropped 34 points and 17 rebounds to secure the dub against the Hawks, while the Nets closed out a win against the Hornets as well. Tonight on Thursday Night Football, the Raiders play the Rams. The Raiders are trying to keep their playoff hopes alive at 5-7, to seven, and Baker Mayfield is possible to start for the Rams at quarterback. And now this. What's good, stars? There's only 11 days left until Christmas break, and we are bringing to you the best athletes drafted at pick 11 of all time. There are definitely some dogs at 11, like Patrick Willis, Reggie Miller, Big Ben, Chelsea Gray, and J.J. Watt. But our goal of pick 11 is Mr. 11, Clay Thompson. Clay was drafted in 2011 at pick 11, and he's worn number 11 for the entirety of his career. He has won four NBA championships and is one of the best three-point shooters of all time, winning the three-point contest in 2016 against his teammate, Steph Curry. That's all for 11. Have a happy holidays. That's all for today from the CNS Morning Show. I'm Paige Van Garrel. And I'm Dylan Grelick. Have a great day. Look, you did it. High five.